Good morning YouTube, it's me again and we're out in the old trusty Kia we're going to go check out some of these lanes out down um, near the River Trent basically there's a few different places I'm going to go this morning um, there's been some really bad flooding in Lincolnshire lately um, my truck's not equipped for going through some of these great briefing I mean I've got road tyres and shit and what have you on but I'm still going to go try as many as I can anyway and document the flooding that's going on at the minute because it's beyond the fucking joke basically um, yeah it's just me and the boy this morning uh, we'll uh, see you when we get there okay so um, it's pretty dry around here this is Bulford Warren one of my uh, usual haunts and it's pretty dry around here so it's fair to say that it's going to be drier than when I came out the other day down the other lanes but I mean they were flooded they were closed and so they may not well be We'll see when we get there. Um, hopefully, we've got some decent flooding because the farmer's been having to keep his uh, animals down here because of all the flooding. Uh, they've all had to evacuate all the fields, etc. Um, you may have seen it all on the local news and shit, but we're being hit quite hard, Lincolnshire, with the rain and that. Um, yeah, I was hoping for a bit more mud, if I'm honest, a bit more fun like, but. Any time off road's a good time, so I can live with that. Well, we're going to get down to the end here. It's going to be a bit sloppy down here, but nothing to really be too worried about. And then we're going to head off to Girton Village and head the back way in there and see if the road's still closed. Uh, see if it's even passable, because it wasn't the other day. Uh, I had to do a U-turn and come back. Um, I also went up to the end of her lane in Collingham and it was totally well it was not a lane anymore it was the River Trent so we'll see if we can add out that way and all and have a look see what's going on down that end a couple of bit of off camera bits here I like this bit it's better when it's really muddy but obviously just pulling straight through that with ease so uh, I'll bring you back when we get down to something a bit more interesting and uh, hopefully some flood okay so this is uh, one of my favorite little lanes not that it's difficult or anything it's just it's quiet there's no one about it's not fucked up you could just poodle along I mean I'm doing that thousand RPM it's fuck all but um, the lane just over this little bit of a hill down the bottom here was proper fucked when I came down here last I mean deep as hell and uh, see the water uh, the pile on there on the left there was big issues with water in this field um, I'll show you when we get there obviously and get a good look oh look looks like the lanes closed all the way back there check this out boy yeah that's what you call flooded lanes. Now there's houses just to the left here. And you can see all across these fields. Yeah, that is the River Trent. And it's burst its banks. Oh, quite badly to be fair. Now if I add a snorkel when I had tyres and then we'd be wading through this but as it stands I'm on normal ride height I've got no tyres um, they're just road tyres and I've got an open air filter because I've got a in on it so he's going to have to do an about face and we'll head to Best Fork and check on the progress of the trend down there so we'll be back with you when we okay so this is a lane out um Fucking hell, I can't even remember where I am. Uh, but this was totally clear last time I came down here. And as you can see, it is flooded. Now, me and the boy, I've just gone travelling down it, probably 50 to 100 yards. But he got all paranoid that we was going to get stuck and what have you. And so I haven't been able to go any further. Um, which is a bit of a shitter. But as you can see, that's supposed to be a field there to our right. And I don't know if you can tell through the hedge there. That's also supposed to be a field, but it's not. 
it's a lake and this is all due to the River Trent um, flooding so now I suppose I'm going to head to Collingham and hope we can get a bit further down the lane down there um, yeah I really wanted to drive this one to be fair but the boys being a fanny and I haven't brought any recovery gear for if I do get stuck so gonna have to leave that one I think just to be on the safe side so gotta get myself backed up out of here now which is a little bit of a single lane round the corner over and up so it's gonna be a bit of a pain in the ass but what can you do oh well I guess that answers the next question about whether this lane is drivable um, there's people that live down here so I don't know what they're supposed to do um, yeah the fields that's supposed to be a field and that's supposed to be a road ad bugger um, yeah well that's loads of fun so it might be a video that just ends up showing you the extent of the flooding in Lincolnshire at the minute around my local area it was supposed to be a decent off-roading video with a bit of um, ploughing through some of that shit and, but it turns out it's not going to happen so oh well I don't know whether I'll upload this or not um, if you like the video give it a thumbs up and all that cobblers um, not that you would and uh, I'll probably catch you next time cheers